Hello everyone, my name is Julio Ortega and I just got these new SE215s that, uh, you, you know, sure, sure asked me to do a review of. I guess they ask everyone who buys their products, but I just wanted to do a video to give a shout out, a shout out to them. I have never done a review, so let me know what, what you guys think uh, down below in the comment section. Uh, and, you know, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll do more. I, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, here it goes. So first thing I noticed when I learned how to put them on <laughs> was that you can do any sort of movements and they will stay in place 95 to 99% of the time. Trust me on that one, I got big ears. Now they really advertise these as being stage ready, uh, going out on the street while still maintaining that immersive audio sensation. But the best part, you can do this. Now, as a personal note, uh, I have always struggled uh, with regular earphones because they would fall from my ears as soon as I started moving, uh, not even like jogging or anything, just walking or moving my head a little. Uh, these seem to be working just fine while walking. I guess I'll play drums or something afterwards to test them with a lot of movement. Right, everyone so in the box you get a complete fit kit of custom sleeves that make your earphones uniquely yours these sleeves are just like the memory foam for earphones or in-ear monitors you want the memory foam trust me on that one unless you have back problems seriously though they have this response to whatever surface they touch and they change their shape accordingly which is really really cool and now it's time to talk about the materials that make this product possible. I read on their website that all premium components and cables are meant to withstand professional performance level wear and tear, which is spot on. Uh, the cable is really sturdy, hard, tough. It can easily last more than any other pair of earphones I have ever tested. Apple, I'm talking to you. In addition to the components of these earphones, they are detachable so you need to replace them later on if they become damaged. So that's always a pretty cool feature. Let's say you have just bought your, your SE215s. If you're like me, you don't know how to put them on. So there's a red dot for the right side and there's a, a, a blue dot for the left side. So just keep that in mind. Identify which side is which and then Start from the back, press it flat or just press the, the, the memory foam, and then just put them on. Put them on like this, and then you, this thing, you can actually roll back. So it looks kind of like this. And then just do the same thing with the other side. Uh, lastly, there's another really cool feature that they added. Um, they have this little thing. I don't know if you guys were able to see that, uh, but yeah, you can press them to your skull, <laughs> to the back of your head, so they will never fall down. I can hear my own heartbeat. I can actually hear my neck muscles moving. That's an added feature I did not see on the website. Now talking about audio, uh, the bass response is really not that much accentuated, but you can definitely hear it cl uh, clearly, which to me, it's way better, which like, for example, if you're mixing, don't mix with headphones, by the way, that's just, that's just wrong. Unless you don't have monitors or speakers or anything, I guess. Yeah, just use what you have, guys. But if you are like, for example, testing your uh, most recent mix, it's perfect because it's got some flat response, some sort of flat response, maybe a slight sens sensitivity in the upper mids, which is perfectly fine. I love the sound coming from these bad boys. As far as muffling the sound coming out from the from the outside, uh, you know, the other day I was trying them on uh, over at the kitchen um, with my dad and uh, he was talking to me. I had them on, I couldn't hear a single thing. He had to be like, hey, can you hear me? Are you there? Are you in drugs? And then <laughs> I was like, wow, I, I really couldn't, couldn't hear you. Cause you know, it, it was at night we were, we were using our low register voice to speak. So I, I really couldn't hear him. That was pretty cool. I mean, I like my dad or anything, but he's gonna beat me up for this thing that, uh, but yeah, they, they really muffle the sound and they're, they're, they're really good at that. 
So I have also tested them uh, while using my E kit. I mean, it's an ele electronic kit. It's a Roland TD11. Uh, but yeah, you really, it's, it's really different than with any other headphones or earphones that I have used. So really good on that, sure. And now there is also a Bluetooth version available. The only thing that I would like to comment uh, about those is, is that if you're going to be using these to track drums, e-kits or whatever, where latency might be an issue, um, just check on your sources uh, specs to see if they can minimize the latency. Uh, as I had previously ordered a pair of these ones, but the Bluetooth ones, and my device was not up to task for that. I was actually getting about half a second of latency. But it wasn't Shore's fault. It wasn't these guys' fault. Uh, it was my device. My my laptop was like it's like six years old. It wasn't on Shore's end. I am sure. I guess the only thing that I uh, that I think was a, a bummer was the fact that um, Shore seems to be having some sort of uh, sale right now for these guys. Uh, I and I could have I could have gotten them for about thirty dollars less. But you know it is what it is. Sure, if you can help me <laughs> get back those $30, that would be pretty cool. I have been using Shure products for quite a long time. They're just incredible. They have great customer service. Uh, my review, 10 out of 10, easily. This is my review, yeah. Um, I really I really think you guys are not gonna be um, disappointed if you decide to buy them. That's gonna be like, they're gonna exceed expectations, if not meet them, at least. Anyway, I hope you guys liked the video. Uh, give it a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content that I that I brought for you guys. Uh, and who knows, maybe I'll do more reviews of my gear. Maybe I'll just stick to covers. Anyway, uh, take care, guys. Wash your hands, all of that, yada, yada. And I'll see you guys next time.